This is Bella Schwalm. She is a junior at Hempfield High School who works at Crusoe's, takes AP classes, is involved with many extracurriculars, and is able to make a little extra time for all of this because of dual enrollment. So basically I go to school for three periods and then I get out at 12. And on Monday, Wednesday I go to class from 12.30 to 1.45. And the other days I just get out 12 and have time to myself. So some of the days I work, some of the days maybe I catch up on homework or go to the gym, and then after later that day I would go back for track or dance theater. There are many things students should take into consideration before deciding whether dual enrollment is a good fit for them. Dual enrollment is an off-campus learning opportunity where students can go, we partner with seven local colleges, students can go to the college and take courses at the college. The colleges we partner with are um, Harrisburg Area Community College, the Lancaster campus, Millersville, Elizabethtown College, Penn State York, um, PA College of Health Sciences, Lancaster Bible College, and Thaddeus Stevens. One thing students considering this program should remember is that there is a monetary component. Dual enrollment does come with a cost, but compared to what an actual college class would cost, it's very low. And it's nice because you're getting the credits for like two to three times less the price you would have to pay at a university. But a majority of the courses are 50% reduction of tuition. So what a student might, who is like a first year student in college might pay, it's 50% less than that. There is a variety of courses students can take through this program. So students can take anything. The, any general education course that does not require a prerequisite because you're getting elective credit here and we'll pretty much accept most courses. To so get the most out of this opportunity, you, you really should have a good idea of what you want to do when you graduate. Because if you want to continue going on to school, the idea would be to have these credits that you're earning at the college because you're starting your college transcript, to have these credits transfer into your college you're going to and, and save you some money, maybe. I would definitely recommend it. I love the extra time I have. I get leverage on my other classes. I have time to come to work, like do other extracurriculars that I maybe wouldn't have. And I know for people with sports, and like I know I'm doing dance theater right now, it's really hard with the long practices. So the extra time like plays a big role in keeping your grades up and like getting to do everything you want to. Although dual enrollment is not the best option for every student, it's easy to see that for some it can be very beneficial. From Hempfield Happenings, I'm Paige Gruber.